Arsenal have again been thrown into the mix to sign Raheem Sterling. Arsenal would reportedly be an extremely attractive club for Raheem Sterling to join. Sterling has struggled for game time at Manchester City so far this season. The 26-year-old has started just five Premier League matches and two in the group stage of the Champions League. Sterling's contract at City is set to expire in the summer of 2023. He was linked with a move to Tottenham earlier this year in a potential swap deal involving Harry Kane. Sterling remained at City but has not been able to be a regular under Pep Guardiola. Arsenal have been interested in Sterling in the past and it appears the Gunners are still keen. Speaking on Reach PLC's Transfer Window podcast, Ian McGarry says Sterling's representatives have informed City he wants to leave on loan in January. Arsenal are the only club named to be interested in a deal for the England star. A move to London where Sterling grew up is said to be attractive for the player but whether City will allow him to leave on loan remains to be seen. McGarry said, it's the case that his representatives have met with Manchester City and are saying to them that their player does not wish to continue or indeed explore an extension on his contract instead they would prefer to explore the option of a loan deal, which they would like to begin in the January window whether or not that's possible remains to be seen but there are several interested parties, including Arsenal. We know that Sterling himself turned down the opportunity to join Tottenham Hotspur on a permanent basis last summer but the idea of moving back to London, the idea of having the guarantee, almost, of a starting place in another elite Premier League club is extremely attractive to him. It's whether or not Manchester City of course would want to see him play for a rival with regards to Champions League placings, title, etc. Arsenal boss Mikel Arteta was credited by Pep Guardiola to have had a big influence on Sterling during his time as assistant coach at the Etihad.